Hello, hi, hi, hello, hey, hey, y'all. So y'all already know when I got the headphones on and I'm sitting in this chair, what time it is? Don't start this shit. It's a motherfucking reaction video. Fall in love with me. I introduce her to the game and let her thug with me. She be like Bunny and Clyde. She even clutching me. I feel like it's do or die. She give her soul to me. She wanna be close to me. Oh, she say she fuck with me the long way. She say she gon' rub my back. I had a long day. Okay, so before my neighbors start neighboring and shit, I can feel it coming. I feel it coming. And then James gonna bring his loud ass out there. I got my sign up this time, so he don't come knocking on my goddamn door. But, <clears throat> oh Lord, clear it, clear it. Mm -hmm. So we about to get into this video. It's called Angry Ken and Karen's Call the Cops and It Backfires two so i guess there's a part one to it i don't know i haven't watched it so i'm watching it with y'all it looked funny as hell because anytime it say karen and ken backfire that mean it's some good shit and it was posted by somebody named ray norman i don't know who that is but shout out to you sir um so we gonna just jump jump right in okay again disclaimer real quick i cuss i cusses i do all the things <clears throat> girl if you don't clear it let me clear my throat Get it out. Get it. <clears throat> <laughs> my voice been real. My my larynx <laughs> been real dry lately. I don't know what's happening. This weather change. But um, yeah, so I got the volume up. I done changed headphones. I done got some little cheap ones because them beats be loud as hell. Because apparently people be complaining that the video too low. But what y'all don't understand is two things. That shit loud as fuck in my ear. And you, if it's too loud, then you're going to be able to hear it in the background, okay? For two, if the YouTube video loud and I say something, you can't hear me talking. So I'm going to have to yell at y'all like this and I don't want to. <sighs> but I got the volume all the way up, so. And I don't know how it sounds until I go to edit it. And what I'm not going to do is re-record it, so. Boo. He <laughs> said that shit a long time. But anyway, we're going to get into this video. We're going to make sure we record him. And it is. All right, let's go. And I did watch a little bit of the beginning. It really is quiet. It's it's not my computer. It really ain't start making noise yet. <clears throat> See, this might get so messed up. Come on with the volume now. All right. Did you call, sir? Yeah. Uh, the family money. Uh, this guy stole her stuff. She's from trying to move. The house at 308. It was sitting outside. And he came in with his wife this morning and stole it. The neighbors over there saw it. She told us about it. And I think you guys need to get it. <coughs> he stole her stuff. No. First off. And it's in the it's in the U-Haul. All the stuff he stole. Where does she live at? Down there at 308. 308? Okay. Where do you stay at? Does anyone live here in 320? 320? Yes. Uh, not that I know of. Okay. okay. So that's, so that's 320 the question. Okay. So well, there's some, some kind of miscommunication. Yeah, yeah. Okay. It, it So is, the I'm resident confused. from 330 stole her property that lives in 308. Yeah. Okay. What did he take? Uh, there's... Do you want to tell him everything that... I'm gonna come close. I tried to steal a TV. I heard somebody broke, so he left it. Where was it at? At 308. So you went inside the house? No, it was in the driveway. Where in the driveway? Um, at the time, I'm not absolutely positive. She was the eyewitness there. Well, then why are you talking if you ain't seen shit? Okay. But they were so traumatized and trying to move stuff that they weren't gonna call you guys, and somebody needs to. Get so this it's back in the guy. of the U-Haul. Yeah, yeah. She came over and he unloaded it out of his garage back in the U-Haul. Wait, he really got busted. what? Hold the fuck on. Hold, hold it, hold it. What? <clears throat> okay, hold on. Let me think. Let me think. Let me think. Am I the only one that's confused as hell? I'm, I'm Confucius because you, you said. You say okay, so the guy 
stole the stuff from 308. The, the, the lady in 308, he took her stuff, one being a TV, from the driveway. And he was unloading it from the U-Haul, but then put it back in the U-Haul? Is that his U-Haul? Because if it's his U-Haul, why is Karen over there talking to the U-Haul? The person at the U-Haul. Like, I'm confused. Who U-Haul is it? Is it his U-Haul or hers? Like, because you said she was moving. So, is it her U-Haul? <laughs> like, it's a fucking U-Haul. Somebody's moving. I don't understand. I'm confused as hell. It just started. Is it just me? I don't know. Maybe it's just me. I always keep going. Okay. That's weird. Yeah, I, I understand. It is. Well, if it's, if it's in the driveway near the curb... That can be mistaken for trash. It's not a mistake. He's a thief. Oh, hell. State, state of Florida doesn't look at it. If it's on the curb, it's considered trash. Whatever. He's it definitely thief. is considered trash. And He's I can't prove that. Simple. Nobody's going to come up and steal stuff like that. Or take, if it's sitting on the curb? It's on the thinking it's garbage. Nobody, it's no reasonable person would do that. Actually, a reasonable, reasonable person would. Where's trash at? Would you come and take a TV that's sitting right there? Yes, absolutely. <laughs> yeah. People do it all the time. Obviously, it was someone was moving, and it was just right at the curb, so it could it, Carly, because she's little, could get it into the truck easy. Mm -hmm. It was moved to the end of the driveway for her to help her with her moving process. That that guy walked right over there and helped with himself with her stuff with his they wife. And I had to go down and check on her stuff several times and, and give her updates what was missing. Okay. So but the issue you're gonna have is it's, if it's at the end of the driveway, it, like trash is, that's if if that's what he mistakenly for it, and then he returned it. Why are you making an excuse for it? Okay, I'm not talking to you. <laughs> I, I, I I, there's no excuse. Job, I have to prove intent. Intent in the state of Florida for theft. It was intent. What intent? You know, prove it. it up. Prove it. Why He'll prove it. You're, you're thinking you know the law, but you don't. Why are you getting? You don't know the law. Because y'all full of shit. Why well, fuck with this cop? I fuck with this cop. This nigga like, look, if that shit was at the end of the driveway, nigga, I'd have took that shit too. Because uh, clearly, y'all racist as fuck, and what I ain't got time for is this bullshit. Because you working on my goddamn nerves calling me over here with this bullshit. Okay? It was on the motherfucking curb. I ain't gonna lie. If I saw a TV on the motherfucking curb, y'all know if y'all saw the TV on the motherfucking curb, you gonna take it. It's on the curb. Like, I gotta at least plug that motherfucker up and see if it works. I like this guy. I like him already. Carly's going you can go inside then. And I usually don't even agree with that. This is my house. Okay. So I'm he, done with her, not you. Uh -huh. He gave Go inside. To a water bottle. This is my house. Okay. I'm done with her. Okay. So you can, you're her? not part of this. Okay. U-Haul in your So uh, let me see if I can make contact with him and uh, talk to him. But at least he gave you most of your stuff back, I right? Think, but like I said, I was trying to go get my the moving truck what? and all my way back. So he stuff. took the shredder, the bike, uh, the pedal board, and the generator, and but my, he gave it back. My snorkeling gear. Is or going. just missing some. What was the paddles? My, my snorkeling gear. Which is the paddles and then the weight thing? No, it's paddles, goggles. I have two goggles. A pad, okay. I'm missing paddleboard paddles. Two of them. Baby, if this I'm man black ain't no way in here, he stole that shit. What the I'm fuck we gonna do? We don't get any water. I'm missing. <laughs> A, okay. a scuba weight bag. I mean, gotcha. we do. And actually, that thing ain't gonna feel this. Okay. He's gonna, okay. he gonna go be. Oh, uh, yeah. Just pretty much all my scuba and snorkeling gear is missing, except the bag and the scuba socks. Um, and so my scuba Sally. flippers, um, it's really hard to find them in my size, and they're really expensive. Have you guys talked Sally. to him yet? No. I uh, to him? I talked yes. to him, and he gave me some of my stuff back, but I don't know what, like, if he's, like, where else is my other stuff? Why would did, he take Did he mention why he take it? Why he took it? No, he didn't. No. He didn't tell okay. me why he took it. And he just left it out in the driveway? Yeah. When he took it. Okay. I'm going to see if I can, uh, I can talk to him. Okay, let me get this. Hold on, pause, 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 pause. I'm, and I'm going to do a lot of freaking pauses so if y'all like kiss my ass. Um, when you moving, right? Um, first of all, why is the U Haul at their house? That's question number one. Question number two, when you moving out of a house, Ain't the U-Haul supposed to be by your house for one? For two, you supposed to be, if, if you ain't got the U-Haul yet, your shit should be in your garage, or if it's going to be in the driveway, it need to be in the front, up front by the garage. 
You put that shit on the motherfucking sidewalk at the end of the driveway, bitch. That's trash. Like, who the fuck moves and leave that shit outside? Like, y'all clearly white as hell, because ain't no niggas I know finna leave that shit outside while they moving. No, nigga, you move that shit from the highs to the motherfucking truck. From the house to the truck. From the house to the truck. What? Bitch, get that girl say my scuba gear. That nigga ain't got your goddamn scuba gear. Y'all need to learn how to move. Somebody need to teach y'all instructions. Uh-uh. What the fuck? See what I mean by him? He's defiant and everything. Uh, well, I said, that he said, if that's... If he interferes, is this He's like, I'm like, is it right here on the curb? Yeah. That's to, to some people can be considered trash. Exactly. Who the fuck put they shit, they shit that they not understanding the whole earth. concept of, I have to prove intent. Yeah, that's, you must just move in. That's a clean ass house. Well, he, he returned most of the stuff. Uh, so, I don't know if he thought about throwing away. Oh, here we go. Oh, shut them goddamn dogs up. Oh, Lord. Come on, man. Not in my ear, Lord. Not in my ear. Hello. How are you doing, sir? Can I talk to you real quick? Can I talk to you real quick, sir? Damn, I'm not finna listen. This shit is loud as hell. Uh-uh. Can I talk to you real quick? Hey, uh, what happened with this whole uh, generator and paddleboard stuff? Okay, so you're not gonna talk to me? What do you want to know? What happened? So did he think it was trash or something? I no idea what. Did he take it? Okay, so you're not gonna cooperate with me then. Oh, Listen, I'm just trying to figure out what's going on, okay? Now we just got either you can cooperate with me, and then we can either fix this problem, or I'll just get her information, see if she wants to press charges, and if she doesn't, I'll just write a cake to the state attorney's office, and they'll file charges or not. So you either cooperate with me or not? So, what do you want to know? I want to know what happened. Yeah, hear how loud this shit is? Okay. Exactly. Okay. Yes. I have a fucking echo on my video. Okay. The guy here on the corner told me about it and said, hey, there's a bunch of crap down there. And I know the scrap is coming through here. So I picked it up, but I put it in right here in my garage. Okay. Right? Yeah. Because, because I didn't want to, I knew it was hers, and I had absolutely no intention of taking it. Because it's hers. Mm -hmm. And second of all, um, he's an, so when he put it out there, it's sitting there, I have a picture of it sitting out literally in the middle of the street. So it's a safety app. Right? Okay. So I came back and I told Mark across the street. I said, hey, I said, when you see something going on, whatever, she shows up in the moving van, let me know. And so I went down there and I told her, I said, hey, I have the rest of your stuff. I said, I have a generator, I have your So he wasn't stealing it, he was trying to help her. Wow. Okay, did you give her all the stuff back? Absolutely. Okay. So three things of value that it appeared that if somebody went by there, and look, I know the history because I know he's got charges pressed up against him, and then he's been a vindictive asshole, like put it on the and she's a victim of fault, right? She's a very nice young lady. Mm -hmm. So. <clears throat> she weak as hell. She looked easily manipulated. I took the paddle board, which was on the outside, I took the generator, and I took the bicycle, which was all laying out there by the way. And I said, you know, I said, somebody's going to come by and steal that. Did he happen to take any scuba gear? No. No. Yeah. She's but, missing that. Uh, he legitimately was well, trying to help I, her. I don't know what else is out. I don't know what else transpired. Okay. I knew the value. The generator was high value. I knew the bicycle was high value. He took all the stuff of high value from out the middle of the street and put it in okay. the fucking you house. Do you happen to have the picture of where the it. stuff was at? Why come outside? Are you going to a restaurant? Not right now, no. That nigga's like, not right now. I'm not trying to be a hard ass. I'm just trying to figure out what's going on. That's well, all. So he's an asshole next door. Clearly. Yeah, yeah that's fine. And I'm not. A, okay. The other cop okay. already I'm just trying to do my job. That's it. He's an asshole down the way, and he's got a charges pressed against him for beating the shit out of him, and that's his second wife, and that's why we knew there was something wrong going on. I got you. Right? He's putting all that business on the first street. God damn. Which, which male are you referring to? 
Say again? Which male are you referring to? Not him. Yes. Who's the other one you're talking about? He's an asshole. Who's the other person you're talking about, though? Ryan, the, the boyfriend that beat the shit out of her. The pilot? The pilot down here, Ryan, beat the shit out of that white... The with the with the Bronco? Yeah. Okay. He, he, beat, he, beat, the, he beat the shit out of her. Okay. And she pressed charges, domestic violence. Okay. And that's why he put all of her shit out there. We had no idea anything well, about I'm, that. I'll fill it in a few details. <laughs> Damn, he's got all the motherfuckers. He's got hey. tea in the neighborhood. That's the same thing. Hey, Sigovich. Like We're 10-4. Uh, he might need you to come down here. It's really weird. So we've dealt with both these people before. Apparently she's moving out of 308. And there was a generator, paddleboard, a couple other things that were sitting about by the curb. This guy came up. This guy that lives on uh, 330, drove by, saw it, picked it up, put it in his garage. Because I guess he knows that she's moving to next door to him. <coughs> Returned it later on. And we know we asked why he took it. Well, I know there's people that drive by and, you know, scrappers and they take it. And he was, I was worried that someone else was going to take it and steal it from her. Yes, but she is missing, like, I guess some snorkel stuff, scuba gear and stuff like that. But he says he didn't take any of that. Apparently, yeah. Yeah. And then the guy, you're probably going to get a complaint because the guy that lives next door to him, I was like, where was it? And I pointed, like, where trash cans sit. And it was, I was like, if it was right there, someone could have mistaken that for being you trash. Listen to Bob's voice, He's like, so if I, if I put something right there, it can be mistaken as trash? I was like, yes, absolutely. Well, that's bullshit. I'm like, no, it's sitting next to where trash cans go. And then, yeah. Yeah, so he raises his voice. He's like, that guy is an asshole next door, needs to get arrested. I'm like, sir, I can't improve intent. If I can't improve intent, nothing's going to happen. Okay. He's like, why are you being so hostile to me? I'm like, you're yelling at me, so I'm going to come right back at you. Okay. Hey, yeah. We'll just see. I'll, 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 let, I'll let him contact Brown and let them to put their heads together. Yeah, so I guess she's she's moving out of there. I guess her husband or boyfriend or whatever beat the hell out of her. So then she's moving down to 228, 328. So, I, I don't know. It's, it's just weird. So. Yeah, it's... And she, if his scuba gear was taken, then it's her fault for putting it near there. Yeah. Yeah. The ge yeah the ge the generator and the paddleboard and stuff like that is, has been returned. Yeah. All right. So, all right. All right. Okay. So we can go. We can go If you need a data book. No, that that makes sense. And you showed me the picture where all the stuff is lined up on the. Yeah. I mean, where was it? So she had all her property was lined up outside on the sidewalk. As you know, when you throw something out or you throw a trash away. So he picked up the valuable stuff to prevent it from getting stolen. I'm pretty sure like, all of her missing stuff is just either lost or stolen by another individual. See what I mean? Or or he still got it in there. I don't know. 
Um, but here was here was this. I, I took so I, I, I took this picture here where it shows that there's here the bicycle is back here and the generator was buried inside. I couldn't lift the two. I couldn't lift these two. Yeah. Right. But to me, that's high value. The bike was high value, and the generator was high value. And then she has every, those three items she has over here. Right. And so here he had set it out this far out of the curb. Even on the can other I, side. Can I take a picture of that? Okay. Just so I have proof. Cause And so I was telling him that this guy, who's running for office, came mm -hmm. by and he helped me put the generator up on the back of the truck. And I said, some scrapper's going to come steal this. And they're going to take it apart and it's going to be useless. I said, it belongs to this young lady. I said, I'm taking it to my house. I, I have every intention of giving it back to her. And you did? And I did. That's she came I, mean, I went and found her. Okay. So, I, don't, I don't have anything else. That's all. I mean, I, I if, you, if, you, if you want... That's my better judgment. Look, if you want, I'll open the garage door and you can look in there. Yep, I appreciate that. Oh, cut the damn. Thank you. Shit. Please don't cut it back on. <laughs> my nerves fucking with my video, man. Nah, come on. I can't even get in my element. Third set again, hot uniform. Oh, I'm the onslaught. Well, you know, there's some people who get really nosy about somebody else's business. I haven't seen it. I haven't seen it. I haven't seen it. Damn, you got a lot of shit in there. Nothing else in here that belongs to her. Well, they ain't not gonna look through all that shit. <laughs> I, don't, I don't have any of it. There ain't no way in here they gonna look through all that shit. Yeah. 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 Again, I'm not trying to give you a hard time. Well, that's fucked up. I have no idea what he's doing. That old bitch ass nigga going to fuck you. I investigate before I do anything. You look goddamn right, man. He's out to get me. This is white on white crime. I just knew that nigga was black. I sure thought he was going to be black. That sounds familiar, actually. Criminal defense attorney, Melvin, big ball, skinny ball headed guy. Yeah. Girl, nobody got your goddamn paddle. Shut the fuck up. Uh, I don't. All, all I took, I gave you. Baby, if the paddle was in the garage. First of all, he had the garage door down. So if you saw the paddle in the garage, how the hell you can see through the, you can see through the garage door? He got that motherfucker up. If he had it, he wouldn't have showed you. These are all my paddles. Them are his paddles. That's my black carbon fiber paddle. If you say it's yours, you can have it if it keeps the peace. I really don't care. Yeah, that, it's mine. I even have pictures that it's mine. Okay. I, I think it's my daughter's, but that's okay. Oh, okay. Your daughter's. That's nice. Bitch. If she thinks that's hers, she can this have one? it. Yeah, it is mine. Well, I think it belongs to my daughter, but... You can have it. You can have it. Okay. What? How do you think it belongs to your daughter? I don't use paddle boards. I have no idea what's in that corner. Because he got a daughter, but she might have bought I would ask for her for a picture. He don't, I'd ask her he for don't a picture. <laughs> Look, they don't fuck with this nigga right here. He like, no, nah, I don't trust that shit. Ask him for the motherfucking pistol. Yeah, they all paddles. They all probably look the same anyway. Yeah. I bet $20 it ain't hers. $20 it ain't hers. Yeah. 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 Give, a, give a picture of, of the one that you have. Well, that's mine. I have a wine green one, but I don't know where it is. $20 that ain't hers, y'all. $20 that ain't hers. If it ain't hers, y'all owe me $20. So all your items were out on the street, right? My cash app is Miranda. They're on the street. Y'all owe me $20. Well, I've been told by two different people when I wanted to get my truck that they were in the garage. No, yes. I can show you the pictures. It's beyond the driveway. Correct. He was trying to help you, you ungrateful bitch. The items he took, he took to keep them from getting stolen and he gave that's them back. That's why, of course he says that, but that's not even true. Oh my god. Well, that, that kind of, 
It makes sense, though, because the items were in the edge of the street. If he stole them, why the hell would he give them back, dummy? The fuck? You ungrateful. I hate ungrateful motherfuckers. Is she the one getting the ass whooped? I'm sorry, now they got me saying the shit. She, she got to be the dumbest motherfucker. It's going to be twice. She about to make me mad. Y'all, I need to get smoke. <laughs> she fucking with my nerves. I just, Apparently, nerves 39 too. said this. The sounds of it. And you can run it by him if you want. What? Everything's going on. What did 39 say? Huh? What did 39 say? He's saying it sounds like this is all going to be. She got her property back and he didn't have intent to steal it. Yeah, no. That's the issue that's you're going to have. Yeah. They doing all this over a motherfucking panel. This is some white folks shit. <laughs> it's some white folks shit. If this was for nigga, that baby, they be arguing over that generator, TVs, PlayStations, here's some pots. <laughs> Fucking paddle, nigga. Y'all doing all this over a paddle? Girl, look at that motherfucking neighborhood. You can go buy another goddamn paddle. Quit playing with me. It sounds good. You just put this stuff out. People took it. He saw it. He took the important stuff again back. Pictures, check out. It makes sense. I can see if she wants to follow that report for the other stuff. And have an unknown. Well, it's really, it's on the side of the road. If it was taken from there, it's, it's not I mean, it's, yeah. it's on. See, I like the cop that's recording, because yeah. the one that's not recording is trying that's to be a the biggest, I'm going to call for it. The know, biggest, what if you have. The one that's, that got the body cam footage is real. He, he being straight up on it. He done went and told his supervisor what the hell he said and everything. You can hear it in his voice, he mad as hell. He breathe hard as hell. He just. Outside doing all that goddamn talking, his ass ain't outside no more. Come on, Kenneth, bring your ass the fuck back outside. You and Carly bring y'all asses back out here talking all that hot shit. <coughs> all right, come on, I need action. Y'all got me staying at some goddamn trees now. Come on, no nobody want to do all that. Yeah, move around. Give me some scenery. <laughs> Can we switch it up a little bit? I can just take a general from her and that's even he just like can we just leave okay <laughs> like he don't even he don't even want to be here like can we can we just go do we have to do this <clears throat> I don't have time for this do we have to do this uh no he did not because he only saw the three things of high value, which is the paddle board, the... Oh, okay, he's on like two one day. Correct, yeah. <clears throat> Damn, I thought this was going to be a little more nope. interesting. That's just what happened when you don't watch him first, but I'm sure I'm going to post this motherfucker, because I ain't sitting here for 30 minutes for nothing. Okay. Come on, I need some. I need some conclusion. I need to. I need some action. What are y'all gonna do? What? What's, what's happening? What y'all doing? Okay. 
Yep, that, that, that checks out, because I, I have nothing here. I, the neighbor wasn't cooperative at first, but once he actually talked to us, it all made sense, and then he showed us the pictures of where the property was at, and it just clicked. All right, sounds good, Corp. All right, look. I don't have anything. Just tell her that it's common practice Ooh, that, gee, hey, you know, you leave stuff on the side of the road, it's bound you to get taken. You can eat it, I'm fairly. Oh, Lord, she's still just talking about the well, gas in Uh, there is no intent for theft on his part. Mm -hmm. All she the, can't even look. You know, if y'all notice, she can barely even look them in the eye. Practice. People can drop by and, and take that all day. Mm -hmm. Okay, thank you. All right. Girl, you need all that shit for nothing. Man. Okay, that was full of shit. <laughs> like, that just made me mad. Like, bruh, what the fuck you do all that shit for? That shit was so unnecessary. That man sitting there trying to help you out. You gonna come in here with this bullshit. Like, as you can see, she was looking at her whole phone the whole time. She couldn't even look the officers in the face. Bitch, you lying. Take the goddamn paddle. The man that gave you the paddle, his, his daughter gonna be mad as hell when she come home and her paddle gone. She gonna be mad than the motherfucker. He gonna have to for sure buy his daughter a new paddle because, yeah, she gonna be pissed the fuck off. <laughs> she gonna be pissed the fuck off. Like, she gonna be mad for real. Like, Dad, you gave my paddle away? Yeah, she gonna be mad. So, we gonna go into the next reaction video. Y'all know I'm going back to my uh, daily public freakouts page. See what kind of craziness they got going on over there. Might hit up a couple of pages. I used to react to a really good one. Now, I gotta think of the name of it. I think I'm subscribed. It's, it's like about police calls or something like that. But, I can't remember. So, until the next one, I will see y'all. Bye.